Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Sarah Pedun and today I'm so excited to give you a garden update. Uh, if you watch my previous video, uh, I planted these raised bed gardens and now I want to give you an, an update. And if you haven't yet watched, you can still go back and watch it. Today, I'm so excited to show you the garden that I built last time. I almost harvested everything before I could show you. Then I remembered, I have to show you guys. Everything turned out so well. Oh my God, look at this flower. It's so beautiful. It has been raining and everything looks everything just looks amazing before i show you the garden i just want to show you my flower this flower i guess it's a weed somewhere i have to show you this flower oh there's a bee so i guess some of you know this flower i had to tell the story behind this flower so one day I was on a border border going to town. Border border is the motorcycle used for public means here in Uganda. So I was going to town and somewhere around Nakawa, for those of you who are in Kampala, someone somewhere there behind Nakawa market, I saw these flowers. There was there were so many, like so many. And I'm like, wow, guys, it looks so beautiful. <laughs> So I stopped the border. I asked him to move with me to pick these flowers because it was quite hidden. And it was not, it was in a public place, but I feared to go alone. So I told him to move with me. And he's like, this is just weed. What do you want it for? I'm like, they are beautiful flowers. I want them for my place. Guys, weeds somewhere else can be somebody's. So I went with him and I picked, I picked the dead heads. I picked the dry heads of these flowers, about four of them, and brought. I shared some with my sister and planted some. And that one is flowering. I'm so happy. It's flowering. And I have more over here that haven't yet flowered. So I'm the total opposite of if you can't eat it, don't grow it. I grow anything and everything. Edible or not. I plant it so I have my flowers and they make me so happy now to the garden so guys I'm right now in the garden and everything looks amazing I see this every day anyway when I walk out of my door I see it so my bok choy looks amazing guys I've been enjoying this I've been eating it I just pluck a few leaves I've, I've been eating this it never disappoints it grows so fast and fills up the garden like you get to see what you've planted sometimes i'm very impatient when i plant things i keep checking the garden to see if they have sprouted how tall or big they have grown so this will help me will help calm me down so if you're so impatient like me what is this weird So if you're not very patient like me, you should plant bok choy. It grows so fast and you can have it for so long. I've eaten this and uh, I think maybe we should eat a bit more because it's it's bolting. I also share it with my chickens. So this is how the garden looks like. So we have bok choy, butternut squash that I'm yet to transplant. I've transplanted a few, but I'm still looking for where to put this. I have oregano, calendulum, such a beautiful flower. 
I have beetroot. Overall, the garden is looking so beautiful. I have red cabbage. This is a spider plant. I have some amaranth, tomatoes. Some of the things are volunteers. I didn't plant them like the amaranth and the okra, the local okra. These are volunteers. And of course, I have some weeds that I need to weed. And the Swiss chard doing amazing. Guys, it looks good. Swiss chard, commonly known here as spinach. I don't know really why we call it spinach. This is a daisy. And this is, oh God, forgotten the name of this flower. This is a malakwang in my local language. It could be weed somewhere else, but this is delicious. We enjoy it. Some little girl told me this is called Heart of Jesus. <laughs> Turmeric. Tomatoes. And the marigolds. So that's for this garden. This first garden did so well. This not so well. I have tomatoes here. I don't know if it's a cherry tomato. This is also a volunteer. I didn't plant it. It's a volunteer. So here I have another daisy. This is Swiss chard and some cabbage. Lots of weeds and volunteers. This is pepper. This is a volunteer loofah. I'll have to remove it from here. It's still weedy. You have to weed. And this is parsley. Oh, no. This is celery. I planted many here, but it's, this is all I can see. I planted a row here. But that's all I can see. Then I have some onions. Same with the onions. I planted them in rows, but they really did bad. This garden didn't do so well. And my beautiful flower. have the flowers here. Over here, there are some carrots sprouting up. And this was another row of the Swiss chard. That didn't really do so well. And uh, things just did not go so well in this area. So this is the third bed. It's looking good. So over here I have cabbage. Um, I planted parsley here and I don't see anything. And everywhere else I planted, I, I don't see it. So it's okay. So here is like a nursery. I'll have to pull out most of them. I'm going to transplant most of them. The onions in this bed did quite well. They're not so bad, but I'll have to transplant a few. Carrots. Over here, I have beetroot. And there are some baby ones. If you have watched my previous videos, I had corn all over this area. But now I have tomatoes growing. I also planted some onions here. Um, not so bad. I'm going to transplant them. So over here, I have some butternut squash. It's the first time I planted this, and this is from a store-bought butternut squash. So I'm excited to see how it turns out. The, tom the, the sugar cane is looking good. Turmeric. I almost don't want to show you the the tire garden but i have to guys i let out the turkeys and they ate everything just look it was a beautiful garden and just a few minutes away from them they ate everything gardening is not for the faint-hearted i'm definitely going to plant there again Oh, I have corn that is almost dry. 
not the best. The chicken, the turkeys can enjoy. That's gardening for you. Sometimes the turkeys eat. Sometimes it's the grasshoppers. You plant again and keep going. Oh, no coming out. Oh, you're not coming out. It's already late anyway. Okay. Just for a minute. Thank you so much for watching. Salamat. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you haven't yet subscribed, kindly consider subscribing. Like, share the video. Click on the notification bell so you never miss a video. I'll see you in the next one.